Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel and welcome back to some more Rogue Tech where today we are staying on this planet. I did toy with the idea of moving planet but there isn't really anywhere to go that's dramatically better than where we are. And there's still a few missions that we could do here so we might as well stick it out and see if we can get that Davian Affinity. And we might as well take a look at the store because I haven't done so in, well, five seconds. Handheld Gauss Rifle. LRM 20, a VTOL Academy, a VTOL appointment, 115 million. Okay, that has got to be a typo. 150. I've never seen that ever in any playthrough. I don't think I've seen that totaling all of my playthroughs. That's got to be a typo. Well. I don't think we're going for that. No. Right. Um, Mech Bay. Nice we do to need to repair some damage. But which is not much, admittedly. So. Three days and we're back up and running. We might have to wait a couple of extra days because the pilots are still fatigued. Uh, they're all back. So, the Hellspawn and Puka. I don't actually know what I'm doing with either of them yet. Hellspawn might get some MRMs, if I'm honest. Might get some MRN, MRMs. But we're going to go do a capture base for today. And let's see what we end up getting. So... It did get this... Oh, okay. I thought it jammed. How did it cr get blown up? It's got a, someone did some tandem damage to it then, clearly. Ah, that's kind of annoying, because I don't have... Oh, no, I do have another error in five. Ooh, okay. Straight swap. Yeah, okay. Fair enough. Got to wait one more day. Done and always good to see you. Yeah, let's go in. Let us go in. Six mechs. We're losing the fire B because Fury's out. It's her mech. I've only been in six times. Oh well. You know. You keep getting shot in the head, you're gonna have to take some time off. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you do, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Let's get into another fight. Let's grind some more good stuff and see if we can get a good mech out of this one. Alrighty ho, let us go. Interface initiated. And, well, I would say find a mech, but I don't think there's gonna be a mech that I find here that I'm gonna be keeping forever and ever. Okay, I don't think we're going to have any turrets in this mission. No. Let's trigger the base. Oh, straight away. So we've just got Occupy and then we go... So there's no like blockading force of any kind, which is good. I don't know if anyone can get in there this turn. No. Location confirmed. We have to split up a little bit, I think. Location confirmed. Yeah, we haven't got a hover vehicle of any kind, sadly. Roger that. Um, you're not a hover vehicle. You can go in the water, but that doesn't mean you're going to get there very quickly. Um, yeah, go there. Confirm. Go there. Moving, Commander. Small border received. Oh, that might get in there. And then you can go there. On my way. We are in. And now we have to get, wait for the game to Moving deploy out. the Moving, enemy lance. Moving out. I'm not entirely sure On where the they're going to drop it. 
positioning the rounds. I've got there we go. Reinforcements. They're heading your way. Where are they? Ooh, down here. So there's a commando, stinger, and a locust. Good to go. Something tells me. I'm not gonna hit my very way. well. Well, you know, that's fifteen percent. Firing a full salvo. I've got a few shots in there. They got a few shots back. That's the back armor of the guard. Uh minimal damage on that hit. That's not too bad. We have height advantage over these guys. 25%, 22. You know, five shots. Confirmed. I can go all six, but I just jam too often when I'm going all in. Ooh. They don't like the gum. Reporting heavy damage. And they're hitting the side torso that has the one weapon of them back Moving, here. Commander. So 20 and 17. I think we keep up with this guy. Just because we might as well focus Stand him down by. even if I don't have the best hit chance on him. Go there. Coordinates received. 17, 15, 22. We'll go on there again. That's not bad. Need something, Chief? Uh, 29 is pretty good, actually. Just out of curiosity. 55. Okay, that's that's a much better hit chance. We'll go there. And we got him in the face. Yeah. And yeah, go there. Received. Decent hit chance there. Again, we got a much better hit chance with the LRMs here. The leg open, but not but not broken yet. The two mechs are damaged quite badly. Okay, let's not have them fire on the scorpion too much. What's up, boss? On my way. Let's go there. So about the same hit chance we got. This guy hasn't fired yet, so we might as well fire on him. Missed. Small laser missing. Waiting for orders. And the garb. 37. 37. I go. 20. 30. 50. Well, let's go there. And hopefully we wreck that leg. Targeting Alpha Strike. Oh, just the entire mech. They took out the light PPC, Let's which would have been destroy. nice to take home with us, but so be Ready, it. Moving, Commander. Uh, yeah, go for this guy. Got him in the face as well. Heavy hit there. SRM LK ammo yes, is not bad. On my way. It could probably go boom. For an alpha strike. There it goes boom along with the whole mech. Fine. Mech destroy. Good to go. And I kind of want to just stand and shoot this. All weapons to go. Ready for orders. And again. Ooh. Missiles are too close. Let her rip. Might as well just stand and shoot though. Receiving you. And again. Firing on target. Waiting for orders. And can you get a direct line of sight? No. So we're just gonna stand and shoot you. Uh commander? On my way. Not the best hit chance. Everything but I we get. do hit him, we do stress him out, so that way all the standing and shooting I've been doing up here, he has less chance of hitting me. He still hits me. With one laser. Is that all he's got, by the way? That's currently active. Ready, yes. Fine. 20% hit chance with the missiles. Rocket 10! Did he fire them then? And they might yeah, have Commander. fired them. Ooh, that's 
go for the kick. Let's go for that kick. Location confirmed. We connect. We, we, we connected with the kick. kick. It's a whole new way of saying it. Connect. Receiving you. And, well, 26% chance. 29. We go around the back. 32% chance with the missiles. Let's go with that. On my way. I just realised I'm going to straight fire my own gun, but... No, we're good. We're good. That is that down. Mission complete. Well, that was one and a half skulls. I think we might need to go for bigger Mission missions. I think we might need to find a two skull planet. We barely took any damage there. I mean, moving planet isn't a good idea because it gives us the chance to get uh, bigger missions, therefore bigger mechs, and a, a new chance to find some better pilots, which I think is key to making progress. So we got some money. That's good. I mean, is there anything left of you? The SRM4, one bin of ammo. The LK ammo go boom. Stinger, we blew up the only weapon you had, the light PPC. Okay, well, let's take that. If I, right. So if I take that and then click disassemble, let's see if it disassembles this now. It doesn't. Good. So... What am I taking? I'm going to end up with it all, aren't I? So let's just take that. Take that for a bit of money. And the engine for a bit of money. I pretty much got it all anyway. So Rocket 10. No, I prefer Rocket Packs if I'm going to get anything. So I'll just get rid of that. We'll keep the SRMs. They can go. I'll keep that around for the moment. We're still building mechs. So it's good to have a good selection. And yeah, I'll keep the rest. Cool. Right, let's go find a two skull planet to go to because the missions here are too easy. And that's kind of boring. Let's face it. It's just boring. There's only one duo duel. I don't think we could do a duo duel at the moment. Mainly because they'll bring the Erby rocket spammers. And I don't think my mechs could hold up to it. Two skull yeah, planets. Yeah, okay, we're mining. just gonna scrap that guy. It's just extra money, and the easiest way of getting a lot of extra salvage. And. Hey, Commander. Yeah, so it's a stinger. Meh. 39,000. Energy accuracy was there, though. Okay, I, I think I saw that. We shall uh, see where it's in my inventory at some point. There is a flashpoint up here. Special delivery. And a runner restoration. I might actually turn that off. Test drive. That's a good flashpoint. If we can get that to come close enough to us, I'd go for it. Right. Lots of green. Is that 35? That's 30 days. 34. 33. Hmm, what about one and a half skull then? There. 27, 26. That's a pirate world, so we'd fight pirates. What's that big planet? I don't want to go there. Ooh, former Star League presence. Well, there is a contract there. And that'll save me 25 grand. Let's go see what that mission is. Oh, it's actually dropped this mission in now. Oh, we can just do it there. Practically the same. So 26 days. Yeah, we'd go over the financial report. 
Well, let's go to the store and sell some junk. See if I can get below... I'm not going to be able to get below half a million sea bills, am I? Although, I do have some other stuff. Um, in... Yeah, I'll go. You know what? I'm tempted to get rid of the heavy ammo. In fact, all of that... No, the light rifle and medium rifles I'll keep. Okay. We'll keep the rest. Two light PPCs. Yeah, not much there. We are getting some stuff. Uh, I might get rid of the SRM2. There might be a place for them, but I think we're good. Tandem rockets. Again, rocket packs. Tandem rockets. I mean, there might be a place for them, so I'll keep it. Streak MRM half. I don't have the actual weapon system, sadly. Uh, let's get rid of some of those. And I've got loads of engine cores. Right, I suppose I should get rid of some of these. I don't need this many. Uh, 145, that can go. 155 can go. Uh, do I need that many heat sinks? No, I'll get more. Let's get rid of eight. Do I need that many coolant? Kits. Climb ones I'll keep. Uh, you know what? I've got two mechs I'm building, so probably worth keeping them because it leaves me one of each spare. Ooh, I'll give her one mask. Gets me. It's getting me a lot of money. This, so that's good. And then yeah, mech bait. I should be able to nice make to a little bit more money. Because I've got a cargo truck that I can just scrap. And that puts it down by... Le less than a... Like, pennies. Literal pennies. Uh, we'll get rid of the Locust. Commando. Uh, Kid Fox is worth keeping. Saracen. Raptor. Clint. That can go. And Bradford. That can go. Yeah, it's fine. Cool, right. So, command center it is. We got a bit of money. That that's good. We didn't we reduced the cargo by about fifteen thousand roughly. Gonna go all salvage here because why not? And I wrapped up that job you asked for, Commander. We might as well take a look at the mechs. So Let's take a look at the Hellspawn, because I have an idea what I want to do with this guy. There is an... Ooh, medium pulse? Maybe we'll keep that. So, let's go for maybe a 180 to begin with. Max the armor. We've got the MRM. Can I go on the arm? That can go on the arm. Uh, ammo. Oh, I didn't get the ammo, did I? Balls. Yeah. Do I go with three SRM fours then? I think I might. Rocket pack is actually be pretty good. That's five. That's sixty damage. You know what? Sod it. We're going to go like that. Like that. That's going to be an SRM 6. I do need some cooling. It's going to be a double heatsink kit. Prepare that. Light ferro. a little bit more to work with at least and yeah we need heat sinks so just three and then we have medium
impulse. Do we have any AMS? No, we have a light tag. That'll help. Let's go down a tiny bit. Let's keep some leg armor. In fact, yeah, like so. So we've got three tons to put ammo in here. Yeah. Ooh, mag pulse. And regular. I think that works. We've got one ton left over. So let's see what we can add this. Energy accuracy. I mean, that helps the pulses. And I think that's just good. We've got nothing. We got some peel and stick. We do have some peel and stick. And we've got a supercharger. I don't think we need a supercharger on this. Plus, we wouldn't really be able to run it. Beagle probe. One and a half tons. And roughly a about half a ton left. Yeah, about half a ton. What are we doing? There's not much we can do. We've got upper hardened. 0.23 of a ton. So we get case. We get 10% armor and structure in the location. We get seven extra armor on that arm. I don't know if that's truly needed, but maybe. So what kind of speed have I got? Four to six. I mean, it's good enough. What if I go 200 rated engine? But two times too heavy. But that's partly because of that. What if I go full ferro? Clan ferro. I still be left with about half a ton, but I'd be moving four to six still. Okay. That's just costing me more. Light ferro. We put the heat sink back in there, which is somewhere. An engine. Change that back to a 180. And we change the light tag for a full tag. Done. It works. Two and a half tons of each of these doing six of damage, five uh, salvos, and then we're down to just the SRM and meter pulse. And the tag, obviously. It works. Right. It works. I'll get it in the schedule. The lamb. Let's see. We've got a stealth lamb built in. We've got lamb composite left over. We're going to have to drop the protos. Uh, Bolt and tan and rockets might as well stay. I'm going to drop that. So, ah, there was actually bombs and that in the other planet, but never mind. We are smalls. Let's start with those. And then we want a relatively small engine. 150. It's about all we can fit. I'm going to go... I actually don't want to risk a heatsink kit, if I'm honest. Because I half expect this guy to go boom. But that's where we max the armor. And 
we have to drop a little bit, aren't we? Should we go for dropping head armor? Maybe not that much. No. Let's go from the arms. So cooling is decent. Might I might well put the clan double in there. So I've got no Lam XL engine, sadly. And I've got four tons left over. I can put another turbine in here. I don't think I have another one, no. Eagle probe? Eagle probe will help. I know where you got the AR-12 already, so don't care about that. Okay, nothing there. Uh, we can put the light tag in. I think the rest will be bombs and that. And we'll see what space we need. I won't put that in just yet. Give me more room to put other stuff in. I know I'm under tonnage, but so be it, game. Log and note. Right. Shouldn't be too hard. Let's continue our journey. I just realized we've got a uh, defend base at the other end, which is a long ass mission. Got a new it's going to be a long video, people. going to pay them minimum wage this time. Because we don't have that much to repair. And I think we'll still get most of it done anyway. Eh, not quite. But the Puka will be. The Hellspawn takes a little bit longer. But we have got Fury back. We have got the high capacitor stuff repaired. So, not doing too badly. Hopefully we find a good pilot. And this planet is nice to us so I wonder if that's not a great job let keep working at it uh, we lose one medium laser oh well and striders in low spirits oh well so keep going for the moment those upgrades you asked for are Do online we go for another one Gets us some more morale, doesn't it? 400,000. That gets us the ability to do more stuff. Roger that, Commander. Let's go for I'll that one. Morale is helpful, I will admit. It's just we don't need it right now. Alright, let's not go for the mission just yet. Let us check the hiring hall for starters. Figgin! Your artillery? Are you not? No. 30% chance for Op 4 pilots to punch out. Uh, cool shot bonus of plus 5%. Uh, two, plus 2 offensive push accuracy. 1 mech tech and 20% upkeep. Just the Gulag Warden is amazing. 30% chance for people to punch out is amazing. Tank Girl! You're one of those rare ass pilots that's we, we can't hire just yet because I don't have the space for. But we're getting, if I remember correctly, this one here unlocks this structural repair. Or was it that one? That one. Whatever one it is, we will be able to get you very soon. Let's check the store. Ooh, what are you running? Mag shots and jump jets. Okay, nothing spectacular. And machine guns. Okay. Bolt on Inferno rockets. See, stuff like that isn't too bad. I've got a lot of open hard points for that. So, you know what? New weapon systems available. We'll take those. Large pulse. Ooh, advanced optics. Not as good as it used to be, so it's not instant buy. There's the. <laughs> Air Academy VTOL appointment is ridiculously expensive just on this planet. Excel engine! Ah, right, so high explosive bombs from the bays, clusters, bomb clusters, times two. 
So, yes, we have them. We don't have the bays. Well. New equipment available. Let's buy a couple of each. Oh, you're very expensive. We'll leave you. We don't need that much. And right. Before we go, let's check the barracks. Let's give everyone some um, much needed experience. You can have that. Mech warrior training complete. Got by. Nothing. Not really. Bloody Ready, doves. Commander. Let's give you some tactics. Uh, that will give you better sensor and sight range. Hopefully better. Uh, just yeah, aim commander. better. Dream. What are you in? The enforcer. Well, you know what? Focus five minus one recoil. That actually could help with the PP. Sorry, the plasma. The common rubber it gets recoil on us. Nothing for you. Uh, Fury, you're in the fire bee. Let's have you go focus. No, we're gonna go bandit with you. Mech warrior training complete. Waiting for Leaf. orders. Uh. Fine, we'll get that. Training confirmed, Commander. Omega. It's going to be Bandy, I think. And then a bit of piloting for more movement. Training complete. I'm using a lot of missiles, so I might as well go with um, Bandit. Because it gives you the 25% crit chance and 0.5 clustering. For missiles Mech that makes them more dangerous complete. so yeah let's go into the fights and let's have some fun hopefully this isn't too long but we shall see right so the puka is i don't think we've got anyone oh no wait no we've got no one that can do that just yet we've got no one that can fly the puka just yet but Let's get it up and running so that we can get it on the battlefield. Figgin, we'll go in the Hellspawn when that's up and running. And do I keep you? I think I do. Do I keep... I think I keep everyone. You're the only one that I don't necessarily like. But you have got Garden ECM, whereas the Fire Bee does as well. Just more armor, so we'll keep that one. It's fine. Right, let us begin. So, ten turns we have to do. We have to survive. Nice and simple. Uh, not too long. We're going to go up here because it looks like... Who's this over here? That's the bad guard. Okay, that's, that's a good place for them to be and us to, to drop. So, I'm happy with that. There's our um, escort engineers to start up the turrets. They have a wasp. Heavy PPC and a scimitar. Okay. Good to go. Say we have a, to survive 10 turns. No, we have to survive 9 turns. Because the first turn is actually just a brace turn, isn't it? Ready, Where commander. nothing happens. Moving, commander. What's up, boss? Uh, let's hide you back here because you are flimsy as toast. Ready for orders. Uh, yeah, go there. Move order received. Again, I should be turning ECM to active. There we go. Heading out. And orders. you don't have any. And you probably want to join the centurion up the hill. Although they're point blank to us anyway, so missiles don't really make much sense. But I have a nice gun line. And let's go dead fire. 25%. Can I get an advance on 25%? Not really, because I can't really get an angle. 20%. It'll be 20% there because broken line of sight. 
with 22. So potentially the only other way we can do it is by sprinting. No, I don't. Ooh, that's 25 again because we're sprinting. So no, let's just move. Go there. On the move. And fire. Dead fire. Got it. Good solid hits and a face one it looks like. Good to go. No wound out of it though, sadly. 28%. Ooh, yeah, go up there. 30% and 63 on the little tank. So let's take him out before he gets to fire. Locking in all weapon systems. Or not, no, because we missed most of that. Waiting for orders. Counting my explosions before they on happen. My way. 29. Yeah, just go here. Firing full complement on I mean, enemy. one out of two weapons hits from the enforcer. That's, that's not so bad. 23, 26. 44 with no line of sight. Actually, that's very good. Clearly, you have no... You have two evasion, right? That's why we're hitting so well. Firing all weapons. One down. On and limit. one out of three, I believe. And that's it. Ready, Commander. Bloody doves. It's a terrible hit chance. Can I get a direct line of sight? Not even if I sprint? No, right, so. Here we go, there. Moving, Commander. Nope. Yes. Sending a message. Taking some damage. Yes, Alright, this is who we want to hit this guy. 50%? No, we can get better than 50%, right? 43. 43. 30, okay, so... Fifty percent it is. Move into position. Fifty percent it is. Acknowledge. Well, that's still ten missiles that hit. And there's a lot of armor gone. So we have the turrets up and running already. Lovely. They're gonna wreck the wasp, hopefully. Okay, this guy gets to go first. Oh no. Was back around to the beginning of no, I don't know. He gets to go. He's at the bottom of the initiative, isn't he? That's right. Ooh, missed. Ready, Commander. And well, let's go. Moving, Commander. There's sixty-nine percent hit chance. It's the perfect hit chance. Sending a message. Nearly all through the side armor. Need something, Chief? Someone called in uh, oh, UAV? Yeah, UAV is just there. I see it. Ah, we can't see anyone. But I can go hide in a mineral field. Why not? That is, that is a steep hill to climb. And that's like... Yeah, that, that, that's not where a tank should be going. But it made it up there. Orders? Strider, you won't be able to see anything either. No, you know what? We're going to reserve you then. Let's do this. And Location yeah, confirmed. We've got a good hit chance on you. Giving them everything I've got. Hit the front of the tank, sadly. Standing by. Again, nothing, so we'll let them have a turn. Little goblin speedy across the map, good. Chaff, nice. Ah, uh, Commander? You still got nothing to shoot at. Yep. You have something to shoot at, though. Moving out. 75%, although, yeah, let's just go with LK. Save the incendiary for when we need it, although... Removed. 
So we're going to need LK What's up, boss? just as much. Right. <laughs> Let the little wasp have its go. It's a quick sell for wasp, by the way. Does it potentially have a streak PPC? Light streak PPC? I think it does. Uh, commander? Ooh, it's gone up top. It went up into the mineral fields. Here it comes. Doesn't save it though. It does from the turret, because apparently the turret can't aim to save its life. Good to go. And I am gonna stand and shoot. Because I'm brave. Right. Got it. Light streak PPC destroyed. Why do I always destroy them? I love the weapons because it's it's as long as you have good hit chance, it's good damage. And you always hit with it if you have that good hit chance. Moving, I'm not entirely sure where the enemies are coming from. So we're just going to spread out a little bit. And yeah, you can come down off there. That's probably a good thing. And they will come down in round seven, which is coming up now. Any second now. Heads up, Commander. You've got hostile contacts inbound. So one lance coming down there, and the second lance is coming down over here. No, over there. So both in one direction. That's good. And what have we got? We've got a Uziel. That's not bad. A PPC weapons carrier. A Locust. A Vespa. An Arctic Wolf. Mongoose and another Locust. Stand and there will be one other target somewhere. Problem is, these guys have got spawn protection. So Moving us hitting position. anything is going to be hard, but now let's see how you handle this. Not impossible to do. How's it going? All right, twenty percent might be the best we get, really. Twenty-two. Ooh, MML risks on you. And three light PPCs on a 50 ton. It's a. Is that a. an Omnimech? I think it might be. Vespa has a large laser. We have a one single PPC. An Arctic Wolf at the back. We can't tell. Fine. Well, we actually have the best hit chance on. The UZL. Roger. Have some damage. It's not great, but it's something. Possibly should have actually gone shaft down here. Standing by. But I forgot. Right, I'm gonna reserve you. Ready, Commander. He doves. Let's have you go there. Moving, Commander. 13, 15. Again, I possibly should have waited. Yeah, let's just brace. I think I'll reserve everyone else until they start moving and then we'll go. Yeah, because that was just you running away, which doesn't really help me. Rider, rock. No, need them to come closer still. Oh, another UAV from the Allies. Interesting. C3 network from the UAV, I believe. Okay, let's just reserve until reserve they've action. come closer. Come on, people. Come closer. This is the Uziel going. A risk Uziel. Interesting. Ooh, swarm missiles by the looks of things. It does use clan ammo, doesn't it? Risk MMLs. So... If we want to use them, we would have to take the whole yes, Commander. mech with us. Let's go there. Position confirmed. And 23... 32...
Panic level critical. Nice. We might actually get that if he punches out. This is where I kind of wish I had um, my new pilot. Commander? And potentially, he would be punching out. 63%. Burn. That is good. Panic level already critical. Getting hit by all that is going to scare you again. This guy going. Mongoose 86. Is that eight, uh, 30. 86 that it was made? Orders? I don't think it was the year that it was made, no. Okay, you are at I'm long away. range. Well, let's get some more damage on him. All weapons are go. We got some damage on him, but he's not panicked out just yet. Ooh, good damage from the little turret. More damage. And the best book getting missed. Fine. Right, now we should be able to hit them harder. If I can get my keys in order. Let's go Moving out. there. That's the back of you, but that's a terrible hit chance. That's a reasonable hit chance. I actually think hitting you might be a good option. I haven't got a decent hit chance, so... Of course, we're going to miss everything. Why not? He's jammed. From something. Ready, Commander. Might go sideways. Moving, Commander. Hopefully good damage. Make you punch out? Not yet. Something tells me he's probably not going to punch out before we explode him in some way. Receiving you. That might be a dead fire shot. Yeah. Acknowledged. There's the arm. So that's a weapon system that off the board. Good. Waiting that's for order. Modius. Move order received. Let's go to use Ale once again. Let's go incendiary. Let's make him hot. Hotter. No punch out yet. Right, this guy's getting to go. Might have scared him off. Nope. He's actually helping and hitting like PPC Just annoyingly. How's it going? MRM. I can get a clear line of sight. 56% hit chance. Let's do that. Confirmed. Roger that. And he's stressed. Good. This is you going. Let's see what you do. Damn. Damn you. I'm gonna need a medic. A face shot is what he pulls off when he's panicked. I'd, I'd hate to see what happens when he's not panicked and he's um, doing well. He's slightly toasty. I told you. He wasn't going to punch out before I blew him up. It's just the way things go. I'm pretty sure that is an XL engine. Probably an inner sphere XL engine. That's why it blew up from the side torso exploding. So don't think it's a clan mech. Or that version isn't anyway. Not with risk technology anyway. But the wasp went as well, so that's two targets down. Now we can work on the next things that come in. Which is going to be the locust by the looks of things, really. 
And uh, Asmodeus is going to have to not do much, really. We've got the Arctic Fox. Not clan tech, so I'm not overly interested in it. Okay, we've got one. Five rounds left. Once this round is finished off. The turret's going. And now we're done. Right. A decent hit chance on the Vespa. Let's go for it. On it. Ooh, got it, but not enough to kill it, sadly. Waiting for orders. Scorpion. 30, 56. Did you move last turn? Not really. To evade him. Fine. Engaging. He's going to be down this round, most likely. Ready, Commander. Moving, Commander. 50% uh, hit chance should be enough. Down goes the VTOL. Leak watch over. And uh, they are yes, starting to crumble. Thirty percent, twenty-five. Forty-three. How is Deadfire got that? At better range at longer range. Locking in all weapon systems. But I'll take it. Because it's obviously a better hit chance than 25. I don't quite get the range brackets of dead fire. It might take out a building if I'm not careful. Ready for orders. So four activations until bleed out. We got a few rounds before we need to not do anything. Copy that. Let's go for you since you're already wounded. I'm weak, but no. Yeah, Commander. And on the move. Thirty-seven, thirty, thirty. Now we'll go. Further away target because clearly he hasn't moved much and therefore we can hit him and take him out. One less thing firing. There to kill. Basically, if we can take things out quickly enough, we don't have to worry about um, Asmodeus punching out or dying Minimal in the damage cockpit. On that hit. But the more he gets shot, the more stressed he gets, the more chance he will punch out. Straight fire. But he's unsteady. That's somewhat good. Yeah, the hunter took a bit of damage. But the locust is taking more damage. And going. Clearly an XL engine in you because the side torso exploded and you went boom. You are getting hit hard. And. Ready, Commander. think we're going to go on you whoever we can get to shoot you what's so... up okay go there Location Got a better hit chance on this guy, so we'll go for him. Firing. And we got some damage. The heat doesn't really bother me, and we set fire to something over there. Good to Good. go. Ah, you're jammed once again. Move order received. And you didn't unjam either. Standing That's by. not good. So thirty percent hit chance, twenty percent. And still 17. Okay, if I. That's 37. Let's go there then. Or incendiary. 
Better hit chance. It's just a better hit chance. Firing. He is open. Inflicted some heavy damage. Good to go now. Hopefully you try and sprint and then you fall over because you're sprinting with damage. No. What do you need? On it. Uh, right, last turn for you and then we are just going to... Here it comes. Do nothing. That's a good shot. That's you on the ground. That hit something. Please don't punch out Asmodeus. No. Good. He is stressed though. So next time we do first aid. Because it's only the kit box that we have to worry about. Admittedly it's still shooting me. Which is a pain in the ass. So there's still a chance we punch out. Not yet. Good. Hey there. And 37 my let's way. go with that he is getting mildly hotter so maybe we start firing incendiary on him the tires will probably dip with you yes nearly got straight fire on me that would have been bad Right, let's see if we can deal with the Arctic Fox this round. Ready, Commander. 20%. 25. Clear line of sight helps. So if I had some of the forest, that's always a bonus. Orders? Still jammed. Annoying. Coordinates received. Waiting for orders. Uh, yes, yeah, get out of the chaff. Moving to position. And let's go incendiary. Double incendiary shot. We got some heat on him. He's unsettled. Yes, Commander. No, we're not using you. Receiving you. We're going to go incendiary. Thirty-seven. Locking in all weapon systems. Have a little bit more heat. Lovely. Now we're going to reserve you. Hopefully, we can get this guy out before we need to trigger. Um, Asmodeus. Roger that. Solid damage. Okay, yeah, reserving once again. So we let him go, let the AI go. And we go right at the end, basically. Because they are doing damage to him. Poking him. Reserve again. Come on, hit him. Although we we first aid this turn, don't we? That's what I need to remember. Winning yeah. quarters. First aid. Don't punch out. Improved to unsettled. Good. Ready, Commander. I think we might actually just stand and shoot Stand's now. Amazing. There goes your ERPPC. So you got no Don't weapon systems. There. Ready for orders. And that means you are useless. Engaging. Take out your other arm. <laughs> Large pulse laser destroyed. Receiving you. And that will take this. you out one way or another. That's the other arm, gods. You're definitely without weapon Target's systems. You've punched out. All my Mission pilots survive. Successful. And my mechs. So, that is good. Let's see what we want to claim. I don't actually know. The UZL probably is the best mech there. It's the biggest mech there. It could potentially run the 
high ATMs. I don't want that. No, Scimitar. Not really. Vespa, no. Scroll down, see what's here. Um, Locust. 5WT. Comes a C3. Did come with an XL. It doesn't let. Oh, okay, the CC got blown up, so be it. Mongoose. Did come with an XL. Uh, energy accuracy, rangefinder, and a sensor tracker isn't too bad actually. Then we've got the Quicksell Wasp. Yeah, I blew up the light streak PPC annoyingly. It says discount Omni. Uh, Uziel is not an Omni but has missile and has the coolant jacket missile quirk. Ooh, advanced tracker mark 2, sensor missiles. Cockpit to face. Gunnery A and B. Yeah, we blew up the XL engine. Light PPC survived. Uh, most of the ammo got cooked off, unfortunately. But I wouldn't be running that anyway. I think we have a winner. We've got a few other picks left to go. We've got still our choice picks. So tandem. Is this tandem good? I don't think it is. But I can't be. I want to see what you've got before we scroll anywhere. So nothing there. It is a clan omni. So we worth some money. We get a heat sink out of it, or they'll drop out of it. Oh no! Wait, the it's not a clan omni. It is an omni, but it's not a clan omni. But it's running. It's running a double heat sink kit. So if I disassemble that, that XL engine will appear, and therefore we got some extra money. And I will just because it's happened to me once where it's disassembled the use like the mech that I picked. I'm gonna pick these separately and then go from there. I can see the XL engine at the bottom. It's now not at the bottom. Um double hitting get is some money, so that's good. Sensor tracker, range finder. I'll probably drop that. One light PPC, giving us three. Might take that. Tag is always fun. And then the XL engine for a little bit more money. Unless there's. Anything else? No, I think we're good. So we got two more random picks, which are a Lucas piece and an SRM4. Okay, not too bad, but we got a good chunk of stuff there. And we got a mech to run the IATMs. So we'll be building that over the next few videos. So thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you next time for some more mech destruction.